Welcome back to Sorry SI channel. Today I'm going to show you how you can download and import your own custom squad views. So you want to come onto the Sorry SI website, you want to go up to downloads, and then once you're in downloads, FM26 downloads, just click view all and it'll just give you a list of absolutely everything. So mind you here, the TFS, the Flying Scotsman squad view, there's no screenshots or video linked in this yet, despite the fact it says, but that's because I'm doing this as we're doing this, if that makes sense. But anyway, what you want to do is you want to download the squad view, just click download, it'll download straight to your download section. So what you want to do is you want to copy and paste or you want to cut. So we're going to cut this and we're going to put it into our documents. So once you find this, you go into your documents, Sports Interactive, Football Manager 26. You want to go into views. If you don't have a views folder, you need to create it. Just paste in the squad view there and then go into your game. And then once you're in your game, you want to anywhere along here, along the top bar, you want to right click and then you want to click import view. And from there, just the Flying Scotsman squad view or whichever one you do, load it in and then there you go straight away, bang, all populated straight in, you have a new squad view. So this is just the way I do it. Just, I just like to have this information closer to the player. Whereas if you go into selection info, it goes all the way over to this side. So for me... I mean, you could click in highlights, but like if you were to look at it, numerous people at the time, you'd go over here and be like, all right, that's zero goals. Who is it? Oh, it's one of these people. I can't quite see it. But anyway, that's how you import squad views. A couple of simple, easy steps. Like, share, subscribe. We'll see you next time.